Here we go again. I'm still home alone, but guys, listen. Oh, I feel so much better. Oh, God, it feels awesome. But the wife's out of town. She's feeling sick, so. But, yeah, I don't know. This is going to. Look at that. Refrigerator's making noises. It's kind of creepy when you're home alone. But, anyways, I want to make some barbecue chicken today. Bite the kid over. You know, all this is still here. So about her and the boyfriend over and all that good fun stuff. And guys, I think today's going to be the day that we transfer not to and Puff Daddy to their tank. I, it's, it's been cycling, cycling, it's been cycling long enough. So guys, here we go again. Oh hell, while I'm thinking about it, let's just check on them. Cause I've been checking on everybody today. Tree frogs are still cleanish. There's the Playco, which he'll probably go in there also, because they're used to being together. There's our little one-eyed crawfish. The other crawfish, guys, I, it's he's in here. He's inside that hollow piece of wood. Man, I wish that thing wasn't hollow. But anyways, I guess old Puff Daddy and Natsu are hiding at the moment. Hi, cutie pies. So, yeah. Hmm. That was something that big. Okay, there he, he's back there. There's not two. He's doing great, guys, but I know I'm about to stress him out moving him again. So, and I guess we'll find the puffer when I get home. I knew you were in there. Where have you been? We're going to get you in a new tank to guy today. To guy. <laughs> Boy, I can talk today, guys. But yeah, everybody's doing good. Man, I just can't talk straight today to save my life. But during my research, I have learned one thing. I transported Puff Daddy wrong when I first put him in this tank. I just put him in a net and I put him in a tank. No go, guys. He ends up puffing up and just puffing up with air. You've got to burp him. I don't know how to burp him, which I'm going to do some more research before I do move him just in case, but we're gonna get one of those big old dicky cups, which y'all know I use all the time for feeding and stuff. And we're gonna get a net and we're gonna fill that full of water and we're gonna put him into the cup with water in it. So if he does puff up, he'll puff up water and not air. So, but he luckily we got lucky and he did really good on the first transport. So I'll quit rambling guys. I gotta go pick up some parts for work and yeah go from there so but guys let's get a move today all right everybody see where we're leaving i had to go to odessa to pick up all the parts and stuff so i decided when i'll tell you in the car <laughs> i do apologize for that because i do bet it was uh windy we went ahead they only had like 12 left so we picked up the ghost shrimp because i'm going to put ghost shrimp in the puffers tank but guys I don't know if y'all if y'all here and y'all been here y'all remember the turtle here exploded and it killed bullet one of our favorite fish in the entire world sorry to two hands real quick guys i found another one look how pretty this fish is so we're gonna haul ass home we're gonna get them acclimated and i'm gonna let baby bear know because she's gonna be excited we've been looking all right, guys, we're back at the house. We're going to get the ghost shrimp acclimating, get our little goldfish acclimating. And, yeah, I'm going to put him in this tank, and we'll see if the puffer messes with him. We'll move him to the 45-gallon, so it's no big deal. But I think everything's going to be okay. King Daddy Crawfish is still chilling like a villain. Look at the size of him, guys. I hope this camera angle or whatever gives him justice. Look at the size of that crawdad. I'm going to take a few photos. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Pose, baby. But anyways, I hope that served him justice. We're going to let them acclimate for a little bit. 
All right. And if y'all remember Bullet, I was just sitting here thinking he was like the prettiest fathead goldfish ever. Sorry, I got to get me some TV on. I'm still home alone. But he was gorgeous. He was like black, yellow, gray. I mean, he was the prettiest. I call him big brain goldfish. I forgot what they're really called. I seen it at the Petco. But this one's not the same color, but it's still beautiful. You know what I'm saying? And they change colors when they get older and stuff like that. So it's a lot of fun watching them grow. But I'll hush now. My bad. All right, everybody. Just finished releasing them. Got the little ghost shrimp. No, your little ghost shrimp, too. Our new little brain fish. And then I guess we're about to relocate him. And if I've explained it, I don't remember. I probably have, knowing me, I repeat myself a lot, but we're going to relocate him to the turtle pond with all the other crawdads because there's like a butt ton of them in there. So, and maybe he'll be King Daddy Crawfish in the uh, turtle pond. All right, guys, we've got King Daddy Crawfish. Shaboom. He'll find a place to hide. Pond's looking kind of murky. It's definitely time for a, what's it called? <clears throat> Filter change. But yeah, he'll find a place to hide. He'll be okay, guys. We'll see him again for sure. The size of them pinchers, I think he'll be fine. Because I've seen the little ones buck up the turtles and turtles be like, oh, uh-uh. So, but yeah, I just think it's safe for that bit large of a crawdad in there with my special fish. So, but yeah, almost time to move them, guys. All right, I guess we're taking a walk through the house. I've got my dragon hunter tools ready, but we need a large cup. And I've already used all my dicky cups, so don't tell the wife we're using this one. So, but yeah, so you got my dragon hunter tools out because I don't know how much of this I'm gonna be able to record, guys. I gotta do this as safe as possible. Oh, not so. I'm about to come get you, man. All right, party people. Oh, yeah, there'd been no way in hell. Oh, here, get a good look at the goldfish. I had to open the tank, sorry. Oh. Anyways. We're just gonna do Oh yeah, come on, cute pie. Hey, can to come this way? Oh, where did you go? Oh, sorry, that was my bad. Oh, doesn't he look so much better in there? Like there's so much more room. Yeah, I got sand for you. How long has it been since you've seen sand, huh? In my nasty gravel. But anyways, got one more to go. Okay, not too is a lot easier to catch, but stressful. I tried to do a whole thing here where y'all can see me release him and all, but not gonna happen. You know, I'm all about less stress as possible. Come on. There he is. Bub, this is so much bigger. I hope you enjoy it, but we're gonna let them chill. If we still gotta catch up. What's it called? Playco, but let's turn the light off and let them chill for a bit. All right. It's been a couple hours. I've had dinner, done a few more things around the house. I've been admiring senior fathead chilling right there, just loving him up. Um, pond is looking a little clearer because, you know, got the filter changed. But I'm going to turn it around. We're going to turn the light back on because I've just had it off letting them chill. We'll turn the light back on and check them out and see what's going on. But I came out here earlier and Natsu was sitting right here. So he is going all over the place. 
But guys, this gives him so much more room to swim around and do his thing. Our puffer is doing good. I think he or she's just trying to find a safe spot. Where's my favorite spot gonna be? You know, that's one of his lava rocks. That's one of his lava rocks. So, I mean, I do have shells down here. He can sit there and chew on, which it kind of looks like he already has. That one was not broken like that. So, that's a possibility. Not 100% sure. Um, I don't see any of the ghost shrimp. Our new little goldfish, he's like, okay, you, you put monsters in here. And then Senior Cutie Pie's chilling here. So I've been letting him in the house throughout the day, but yeah, I still want to pee and poop. I love you, dude. I don't care you pee and poop. It's okay. You're my, hom you're my homie. So guys, we'll check back in the morning and go from there. So yeah, we'll, we'll just check back in the morning, see how they're doing, because I'm turning everybody's lights off. It's bedtime. I got to go to work tomorrow, all that good fun stuff. And we'll do a final check. Axel, you act like it's hot, son. It's not hot. He's crazy. But we'll do a final check in the morning, and then we'll end it. All right, guys, see you in the morning. That makes me happy. Sorry guys, I was out here watching Natsu in the puffer. Watch him. He is digging a hole, guys. That's what he's doing. See if I can get down there on it. He is digging a hole. That is so cool. Thank you, bud. I think Natsu's like in the sand. All right, I'll go to bed now. I know I always say I'm gonna to go to bed and I don't, but they start doing cool things. And I wanna share them with you all so bad. Right, Puff Daddy. The ladies that gave him to me named him Puff Daddy, so he's gonna stay Puff Daddy. Yeah. All right, nice. Sorry guys, but if I enjoy it, I think y'all are going to enjoy it because I'm crazy. All right, everybody. I am home from work. It's the following day. I went ahead and gave it like 24 hours instead of just like the following morning. I'm kind of glad I did. You know, because we get to see all the digging spots and all that good stuff now. So, guys, let me turn you around and we'll show you what they've done in 24 hours. We got Natsu's chilling. Puff Daddy's chilling. New goldfish might not be able to stay. I don't know because you can see it. the top fin's been chewed on. So, anyways, we'll give it a little bit. But yeah, Mr. Natsu has dug down here. He's dug back in there. And look, he's actually buried the aerator. The aerator stone? Or air stone. Whatever y'all want to call it, guys. But yeah, that's actually really cool. So there's been a lot of progress in this tank. So, sorry, that was too good of an opportunity not to take a picture. But it seems like everybody's happy and doing well. And man, we'll just let them grow. Where you at, cutie pie? All right, just like that, guys, it's over. We'll do it again another day, and we'll definitely update you on these guys. Need to update you on Onyx and all that good stuff. Turtle Pond looks better. Got the filter clean finally, and the box turtles have awoken. They were up yesterday. They're back in today. They're kind of slowly getting up, so more videos to come, guys. But like I always say, I appreciate you watching, and until next time.